What's up guys, AK with DCC Train. In this video, I'm going to show you how to reprogram Digitrax DS74 accessory decoder to different address with ESU ECOS command station. And for demonstration purposes, I'm going to use this module control to wireless throttle by ESU. So the first output connects to that uh, turnout. It's Kato, and usually it's only one solenoid it's changing polarity and that's how it's working so here we go right now i believe address five let's see yeah it's address five and usually groups for dcc switch control it's coming from uh, mostly dcc uh, manufacturers decoders accessory decoders groups one to four five to eight, nine, etc. We talk about Rocco accessory decoders in another video. So I did also update of the my new ECOS system. It's not new, it's 50210. But the sensitivity of the screen a little bit better. So excellent job, ESU. Here we go. So right now it's under address five, group five. So here we go. You can see it also on display over there. Changing, there we go. And now I need to press the ID button till those LEDs start flashing. Usually it's three seconds. And now I'm changing it to address one. Just this turnout logo, it's already selected with address one. Just press it one done we can test it here as well that's my one here we go thanks for watching supporting business if you'd like to support channel please join membership have a good one bye bye